What's up everybody, Oris for Scott here. Today is going to be the first episode of my new series that I'm starting, Live Forts of Photography. In this, I'm going to be taking one car. Today I have the Ferrari F50 and I'm going to be driving out to maybe two or three locations in the map. Um, today we're going to be driving out to the tunnel first. Um, and then from the tunnel, I think we'll head up to the castle here. We'll take a few photos, we'll bring them into Lightroom, do a couple speed edits, and then I'll be posting the three photos to Instagram where hopefully you guys can go over and vote for your favorite ones. So let's enjoy the ride out in the Ferrari F50. yards, turn right. Turn right. In 400 yards, turn left. Turn left. Roundabout, take the second exit. You have arrived at your destination. moving shot so let's see now we'll get into photo mode that looks pretty good already I like that now let's zoom out just a little bit I'm gonna go portrait mode for this tilt the head hide hard let's have a look see what we can get looks pretty good right there okay so we'll take our first screenshot Perfect. And let's see. Uh, we want the car in focus. Zoom in a little bit. What does this look like? That looks pretty good as well. If we actually. I'm going to say, well, I'll just go in a little bit. Actually, think I liked it before, but anyway. I will take that screenshot. Perfect. Okay, we'll go back and set our next waypoint to the castle. Um, 
So actually it's pretty easy, but we'll take the next exit, first left, split right, that's fine. All right, let's enjoy the drive. Okay guys, we're just approaching the castle here. Memory serves me right, yeah, there it is. There's a sign here for Bambra, I think. Weather is perfect at the moment, so what I wanna do is, I'm gonna get a still shot now. I just wanna make sure that this car is not in the way. There's a car coming over the brow of the hill there. If I can. Right, let's go to photo mode quickly and see what we can snap up here. Zoom out a little bit, let's see what... I think I might reverse it back just a little bit so we can get it more... Uh, let's see... Okay, he's just ruined the sign. That's fantastic. Okay, right, we'll get a moving shot first. Um, I think I want the castle behind me and I want to take a front facing shot so we'll, we'll come down here hopefully this resets the sign try and take advantage of the uh, sunny weather clear clear skies Maybe that's not always the best right so we'll do it here let's see what we've got Pretty good. Zoom out. Let's see, we'll focus up. We'll come up a little bit so we can see. We'll zoom out just a little bit more. That looks pretty good. Uh, bring my aperture down just a little bit so we can see the castle in the back. I think that looks great. I'm gonna take another screenshot. I'm gonna just try and see what portrait mode looks like. So we'll zoom in. We can do a dolly zoom. Should have actually gone in for that, but I think it looks pretty good. Let's focus on the car. That looks great. Don't like the danger sign jump above there, but I think what I'll do is I'll just get rid of that in Photoshop, take a screenshot. I'm happy with those two shots. And then let's see if the sign has recovered. We'll go take a quick snap in front of that with the castle in the background as well. It has, great.
Right, so let's... Actually, what I'll do is... Turn the wheels like that. This might be a good shot. Let's have a look. Yeah, that looks much better. That could have been my problem the last time I had the wheels turned the wrong way. Um, uh, okay, I think we... I'll bring the aperture up just a little bit for this. I don't need to see the, the sign. I think this might be better in portrait. That looks decent enough. We'll take one screenshot there. And what I'll do is I will zoom in a little bit. We'll go out. And I think this one will come back down to landscape. Rotate it up just a little bit. And I'll strategically cover. That looks great right there. And we'll take a photo there. Perfect. All right, I think I'm happy with those three shots. Awesome. Right, let's jump into Lightroom and uh, have a look at our final edits. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't done so already and hit that bell notification. Make sure to check out my Instagram page to see which three photos I chose and for you guys to vote on which is your favorite at Forza Stills. Thanks.